It's been a crazy morning. No morning run, no none of that. Um, made a whole video about falling behind. Currently, I'm gonna go in, look at the journal. We woke up at nine, so we definitely did wake up late, but being able to reflect and see, okay, how do I grow into the individual that I need to become? Rather than the goal is what will get us to where we need to go. And so that is my new emphasis on emphasizing the new life, the new person, the new character of who is Lonnie. Rather than making 10k per month or 20, 30, 40, I hate 10k per month. It's so basic, so boring. Go for 50. 50k per month, 80k per month, 100k per month. Like, who is that person that is able to do that? To do such a, you know, to achieve such. So, we're gonna go in. We have work later today, but we're gonna go in also edit these day in the lives i want to have be less sporadic even though my life is very sporadic i want to start to take control and i'm going to be living proof to every single one of you that yes you will fall but if you get up and you keep going and you truly take control and you start focusing on the right things doing the right things you will win in the end i guarantee it so just went in edited the straight recap no crazy edits just put it together um, it is a longer video, it's around 26 minutes, but it's my full raw thought process while I am trading. So you can kind of get a full gauge. Um, that's what I roll right here. If they just want to see the recap, they can skip, skip to 23, 26. Right now, editing or uploading the video about falling off, figuring out what I'm going to title this. I'm about to go and edit Winter Arc Day 12 and upload that right now as well put that together then we still have a little bit more to do we need to do our trade recap and journal before we end up going to work in around an hour so we're really locked in we got to continue to keep going keep going keep going trash talks we are here again the trash bin is in the bushes anyways more importantly today's trash talk is about self-actualization truly analyzing yourself and where you are and focusing on that character development, rather the goals you are looking to achieve materialistic wise. I got too caught up, focused on changing my environment because I didn't like it, quitting my job, making enough money, making 20K per month, making 30K per month, you know, being able to make $1,000 in a single day, whatever the case is, right? Being able to, you know, buy an AMG, all of these other things. I was focused on rather than the actual ability in order to become the individual that is able to attain these things. And it messed me up because it put me on a hamster wheel of growth, thinking I was actually growing, rather I was solely looking to pursue those materialistic things. When you focus on becoming the individual that is able to have those things, that is when, right then and then, right then and then, you achieve those things. Because you have grown into the individual that is able to handle those things. If you, right now, someone who's on your growing stage had acquired all of these things, guess what, you will lose it all. Because you have not yet learned and have attained the ability in order to be able to maintain these things because you're still on your way there. Because if you had those things, then guess what? It would mean you have learned to obtain and retain these things. So focus on the process of becoming that individual and focus on the actual process of growth with yourself, you and yourself. You need to grow. You need to grow, I need to grow. And I struggled at that, but now our new main focus is growth every single day, ensuring that we are truly growing and we're not running on a hamster wheel thinking we're growing when we're really not. So, journal, reflect, spend more time meditating, and I promise, and you guys will be able to see with me as a human experiment, whether or not we grow. Yo. Hey, also like some sandwiches. Lonnie in the gang, bro. Lonnie in the gang. Yeah, there's a lot of shots. Just got done with work. 
back home late. The gym is closed, but we're still gonna hit the gym anyways. You may be asking how. I'm gonna focus tonight on really emphasizing that personal growth aspect and really reflecting. You're just a bitch. Correct. You're, you're honestly, that, that's not me trying to be some after school special shit. Mm -hmm. You really are a bitch. Real men ain't doing it. I mean, real men don't care about that gossipy bullshit. Mm -hmm. Cause real men don't say shit. Cause first of all, we're too busy trying to grind and be better. Correct. Second of all, unless we know what we know, what we know we shut our fucking mouths. <laughs> you're lazy. You know exactly what to do. Exactly what to do. Cause even me, in my state of, I can't read and write. I know exactly what to do. It just sucks doing it. Most people don't want it that badly. Which is why they always ask the question, man, how did you get to where you are? You know how to do it. You know exactly how to be you or how to be me. You don't want to do it. So I can't make you do it. Nor do I have the time or energy to force you into that place that I know you have to be to do it. There's no luck in this game, man. It may be a little bit of luck, but the luck happens after you bust your ass. And you put yourself in that lucky situation. Luck doesn't happen. You put yourself in that situation where luck might fucking happen. You need time alone to discover these things. And some people fight being alone. They fight being alone. They fight being single. They don't enjoy it. They just, anything, just invite anybody over. You invite people over, you don't relax. Just come on over, girl, come on over. Let's just hang out because you're afraid of being alone and you're avoid of thinking. Time alone is important. Time alone gives you, first of all, God discovery. You begin to understand who God is. You cannot understand who God is in a crowd. And Jacob was left alone with God. And God called Abraham alone. And Moses went to the backside of the mountain and was alone. It's always when you're alone when God reveals himself. God didn't show himself to the Virgin Mary while she was in the crowd shopping with her girlfriends. When the angel showed up and said, Mary, you're going to have your favorite amongst women. You're going to have Jesus. She was by herself. Whenever anything significantly happens to you in a spiritual capacity, it happens when you are alone. Can God get you by yourself? You know, or is your life so cluttered with people and things that you're chasing and objects that sometimes people put on you, but sometimes you put it on yourself because you're fighting from being alone. And now you got a crowd and now you don't know who God is. Number two, you don't know who you are. Okay. In order to be, in order to have self-discovery, you have to have privacy. You need moments of reflection. Christians don't use this term too much, but I like this term, meditation. Not levitation, meditation. There's a difference. I used to always spend time by myself, visualizing, thinking, you know. Simple meditation. Just a calm, quiet place of reflection on your life. So we just got done with our daily dose of brain rot. I was on TikTok for a bit. I mainly use TikTok for the filters. As you can see. Anyways, <laughs> it is currently 22.59, 11 p.m. We're about to go in right now for a bit. Edit Winter Arc Day 12 and go in back to us for around 30 minutes. It is late. We're going to go to sleep around 12, wake back up at 7. We are not waking up at 5 a.m. tomorrow. I guess I was sitting there thinking... I cannot allow myself to wake up past 8, so I have to keep it in that range um, on the weekend, allowing my body to fully go in and recover a little bit more since I'm only getting around 6.5 hours of sleep typically on the weekend. That's if I get my proper, or weekday, if I get my proper sleep of, you know, going to sleep at 10. You don't really fall asleep for 15 until 15 minutes. Anyways, 
Gonna go in, edit winter arc day 12, back this for around 30 minutes and finish the night with journaling and reflecting on where we are currently and how we want to grow ourselves and continue to move forward. I've been saying it now, so say it, continue to say it. Our emphasis is becoming the individual that is able to obtain and maintain the goals we are looking to achieve. It's as simple as that. Who is that character? Who is that individual? How does he walk? How does he talk? How does he act? And how do we grow into that individual? Honestly, I think you are being delusional. You might be. So...